Welcome, welcome, welcome everybody to another amazing, exciting round of Narfman's Warpless Tournament. Today on the bracket, we have Teeks88 and the Haxer, two very accomplished SMP3 runners. I am Big Chief Taylor, along with me today, the one and only, needs no introduction, Mr. Mitch Flowerpower. How you doing, Mitch? Good, how you doing? I am excited. This race is going to be off the chain here, and both of our runners are ready, so we're going to go ahead and get the countdown started. As chat knows, there's a touch of delay, so we'll sit here and have a little dialogue. Yeah. Um, so... So who are who are you? What corner are you in? Who do you, who do you want to see? What do you do? You want to see like a crazy comeback? Everyone I want to see. Three hands. I want to see no runaway, bro. Both runners get three hands. I, I want to see no runaways. That's for sure. I definitely yeah. want to see no runaways. I want to see both runners get the same amount of hands. To be fair, because I think the hands are gonna with the how close these guys race and how their PBs are like hands is gonna be such a big factor in this. So I want to just see clean and balanced and just put it all on the skill of the runners. Yep. Yeah, me too. Look at chat's excited. That's Chol, not how you doing? How warpless works though, right? Yes. <laughs> it's never how it works. No, warpless is never, never cooperates. But maybe it will this time. Sometimes it does, right? Absolutely. And fortunately, these two runners know their way out of any sticky situations that warpless can present to them. So it's gonna be. So oh, it looks like we're off. All right, here we go. Any goomby woomby uh, stash percents? Wow, doing 1-1 one, one right off the bat. I'm surprised Light to rub. see that. Oh, man. Haxer didn't do Goombi Woombi. Already so crazy. Teeks didn't either. No bottom strats? Uh -oh. No. No <laughs> strats. How's chat doing, Kurt? Welcome in. Budsy, how you doing? Oh, Every time oh, we slay, nice. Mitri, Malachi, and Assault. Chat is bumping tonight. Movement of two. Oh, both of them get that juicy yeah. movement of two. A nice resync. There we go. Nice resync. Man. So, both runners getting the early P speed. Nice. You like to see that? What's what's the name for early P speed? Just no, just early P speed. <laughs> early early Wii speed. Early Wii speed. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, looks like Teeks just has just a just a pinch of a lead right now. Just a pinch. They both get the same bro movement again. Wow, double movement. So I I think Teeks is gonna go safe here uh, for the orb. I don't know if Haxer does though. Safe. Ooh, both, both safe. Did. Okay. These guys know that neither runner is going to give them any slack on this, so I think we're going to see just as fast and safe as they're comfortable with. Definitely. So the mental game that they're playing right now is the first mistake that they make, they're just going to assume that their opponent... Oh my god, the same Hammer Brother movements. Ooh. But they're just going to assume that their opponent hasn't made that mistake yet either. So it's like, there's going to be a lot of pressure on the runners when they make their first mistake and how they deal with it. It's going to be very exciting. Absolutely. Nice one five from from both our runners here. Teek's still maintaining just a touch of a lead here, but it's like half a second. Not even anything crazy. Yeah, nothing crazy, especially with the same Hammer Brother movements that they're getting. Yeah. All right. Good, quick shout out to Big Mac in chat. <laughs> it's good to see you, Big Mac. Oh, and Teek's with a lucky bro movement there. Okay, not bad. Teek's is gonna fight him early. He's not gonna be able to get Fire Flower, and he's gonna get the awkward pattern. But I think. I think he's done it enough, right? I think he knows. Yeah. So Haxer may look like he's in the lead right now, but he still has to fight the bro. But, oh, he gets a nice bro where he's going to be able to get the fire right from him. So he's going to end up with that better pattern. Yeah, the two extra movements of one right there. Better pattern. Very nice. All right. Well, airship already. How you how you doing, Jahaley? I'm doing great. I'm already pumped. One second race right out of World 1. This fire fight here could determine that one second. I mean, whew. how much difference between PBs? I think it's, yeah, it's very, very small. Less than 10 seconds. Less than 10 seconds. That's right. Yes. Yeah. What's up, Stash Daddy and MFP? Good luck in the comments. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, Denim. Maybe, maybe I got to grow up my stash then, you know? Maybe The stash maybe my... changes everything, but you can't grow a stash <laughs> until you stash do one one bottom round. It's change. It's devotion. You get the beard guys out there who talk about having a beard, but the stash takes more dedication and focus. It is true. The stash is the thing. I mean, I'm a I'm a beard guy, but like not a long beard, right? There's a, I always got the five o'clock shadow going. I always There's got a night. The... Mitri, imagine having a beard. Yeah, Mitri, imagine. <laughs> I grew it myself. Okay, so here we go. Team's gonna enter first. Is. Not gonna have the easiest pattern. He did have a slight arc, but he's Ooh. Good. very nice. What's the difference here, man? 
Oh my god, it's barely even noticeable. And both runners face in the opposite directions. I love that. Back to back. Back to back. Oh man. How are you feeling, chat? You guys look like you're pumped tonight. This this right now, until we get to like semifinals and finals, this is like gonna be this is gonna be like a big dog race here. You guys are in for it. Yep. Yeah, Teeks' it's PB cool. in the tourney race was sick, but Haxer just recently took second place overall in Warpless. So I mean this is these are some spicy guys right now. Right. Is um is uh semifinals also best of three or just finals? I think the semifinals is best of three as well. Oh, very cool. Alright, so our runners are gonna be primarily looking at which direction the Hammer Brother is gonna be going right after this level. Uh, I'm going to guess that both of our runners might want to actually just get the music box regardless to make it safe. Save a P-Wing, not do 5-1 P-Wing, not either have to wall jump or 7-6. But if the Hammer Brother moves left, they're in a comfort zone. If the Hammer Brother moves right, Ooh. Ooh. rest time. And look at that. Both situations you just described just happened. <laughs> so <laughs> There you go. So Haxer's yeah. in good place to just completely avoid the box if he wants to, uh, which... I guess Dom RTA is now being referred to as Cujo, so it's back to the uh, Cujo box. I guess so, yeah, the Cujo <laughs> box. But yeah, we'll see what they do. Let's see if Haxer goes for it. If the bro stays out of his way, I think he's going to skip it if the bro stays out of his way. Yeah, I think so too. He was definitely practicing his wall jump. Teeks, oh. Teeks's hammer brother is actually set up for a TAS early hammer. So that's very interesting. Doesn't get the early P-speed. Haxer does. Haxer's actually going to pull ahead a little bit now. Oh, Ooh. Look, Look at, at the sink. Oh, wow. That's like Intense. that. Because Haxer had a slower 2-2 two -two there. Yep. Intense. Look at that. Hope you know Very I'm missing nice. the New Oak Island for this. I don't know what that is. Is that a TV show? Video game? There you go. They are synced. Again, they're so, phasing back to back. Yeah. <laughs> what, what are these two? Okay, let's see what happens here. Ooh, so Haxer's getting Dom box no matter what. And Teeks, uh, yeah. let's, I think he's just going to play through. I don't think he's going to go for any squirrely death early hammer manips in the race. No, I don't, I don't think that was a movement of four either. But he's going okay. for green rocket. Yeah. Ooh. Haxer getting a movement of one. That's nice. He, Teeks is not going to be able to have that luxury right now um, because he's got both his bros down there. I mean, he could get movements of one, but not likely. Very clean green rocket from Teeks. It looks like Haxer's going to pop this off as well. Yep. Very nice. Green Let's Rocket the... is actually a relatively uh, new concept of Strat. It takes the Red Rocket and normal routing and actually saves a little bit of time. So it's really cool to see uh, Green Rocket. Oh, yeah. And you never get those pesky Red Rocket lag frames. Yeah, get the Red Rocket out of here. <laughs> <laughs> so, looks like Haxer's Bro was hiding over by the Pyramid, right? And Teeks's is just below the Pyramid. So we'll see what level these guys end up playing. I think they're both going to do 2-5, but we got to see what Haxer's uh, Bro does. Yeah, exactly. Haxer's bro is telling him to do 2-5, but we'll see what he has to do. Ooh. And yeah, this also has to go down as well. Teeks is stuck in the, the in-between. Yeah, the bros could kind of be butts here to Teeks. He might yeah, end he up in the four stomp box. Yeah. Oh, right. Haxer's definitely playing 2-5. Haxer is in a great position right now, getting those movements of one, and he has the comfort of going down and no extra map movements. Very, very good. Yeah. Look at this. What a race so far. Oh, oh, they switched. Oh, my the no. Jerks. So he's getting so, the forced. Yo, WRD, he's getting that forced Dom box now. He's going to have to play it, isn't he? Yeah, he's got to play both of them. But yeah. luckily, it's not going to compromise his fire kill, thankfully, because he's going to move up after the pyramid, fight bro, come back down. Right. Very interesting stuff. I got to talk to Haxer about that chest grab. He's always a stickler for getting it as soon as it spawns. And he was a little late there. I'm going to have to remind him. Lost a couple frames? Damn. Yeah. What happens? When I did my coaching session, he hammered me about grabbing that chest. <laughs> yeah, chest grabs are very, very important. Like I said before, in between chest grabs, menuing, and overworld map movements, like tons of seconds can be lost. It's crazy. I'm going to go ahead and switch the uh, audio back to hack uh, to over to Haxer now because he is technically in the lead. He is currently in the lead, I think. They might sync up here, but I think Haxer took the lead, yeah, with the uh, movements of one here. Yep. Just a little bit, though. Is he at an 8 12 A press? Maybe early 8 13, and Teeks is going to have a, an 8 17. So five yeah, seconds. Teeks got to move into four. Oh, the too. throne room jump on both sides. Ooh. That's the RNG we're looking for, chat. 
Will they respect the tournament rules, though, in World 4 Airship and take the screw all the way? We'll see. Cab Audio, you're right. Those were nasty bros. Every time we slay the hype, I love it. So are they both getting the same pattern here for fire kill? Uh, I mean, it's not going to be exactly the same, but you approach it the same way, yes. All right. I think Haxers, Haxers is going to shoot most likely right away, and Teeksy's going to... His boss is going to walk forward just a little bit and then shoot. Okay. For the most part. Chat only trust him. Yeah, Mitri is normally on top of our split time differences. Mitri, what are we looking at here? Is it yeah, five seconds yeah, like I thought? 4.638, technically. Off-screen wand grab? We might see an off-screen wand grab. Ooh. I know T doesn't go for it, but I know Haxer does. And I always like to warn the runners, thanks to uh, the Bagler, about trying to show off. <laughs> Bagler could curse himself a little bit. Oh, wow. Oh, oh, like it. oh goodness. Ask and you go. shall receive, baby. That is going to be at least Woo. at least a four-second time save. A little under. Wow. Let's see when the feet hit the ground. 50. Teeks. Gonna be 57, I think. Nope. 59. Nine second time difference right now. Nothing huge, but to these runners, it's actually it's actually a little bit of a lead here. Oh man. That's, that's a pretty big lead. Yeah. Wow, no frame perfect. Oh, Haxer, we gotta work on that. Let's see if Teeks gets it. Oh. oh nice try from Teeks' side. Nestmaster, you missed an off-screen wand grab on Haxer's part. Spicy stuff so far. I can taste it. Oh. Taste the spice. Are you sure that's not from your HelloFresh box? My half and half spice. Ooh. My cream spice. Cream spice. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, no. Bro, I'm going to poop head oh. move to Haxer here. He's okay, got to be so, careful. Yeah, so stress levels are instantly up for Haxer and oh. not oh. quite for Teeks. I'm not going to say... Guys. I'm not going to say it. I'm not going to say what the bro can do here, but yeah. we all know in chat. Off-screen wand grab's good, but there's something that, that makes it kind of useless. Ooh. And then, yeah. Come on, baby. Down or left. Oh, no. Instant stress. But this is still pretty good for Haxer because he can just skip uh, both Hammer Brothers. He is in that position. Yeah. That guy right? moving down that extra step definitely helps him out there. Oh, exactly. Teeks isn't super clear yet on Runaway either, and Haxer's bro could still come back. Exactly. Yep. 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 Uh, we don't want to. We don't want to see or hear a movement of three on Haxer's side. Uh, somewhat of a long movement that would mean that he went be down below the bridge, which is it's hard for him to come out. So yeah. Come on, here. baby, come back. Make it even. Not Son of a back. gun. I think that was a movement of two. So uh, Haxer's hammer brother is over by the uh, Fort. uh, fortress. That's right. Yep. So he's most likely just going to skip them, considering. He has two levels, which means it can't come back. And if it does, it would after three, right. four, which is really nice. And I think we're going to see Teeks bypass this bro here first to try and intercept his chance of getting run away, bro, because Teeks' bro is still in a crappy spot. That's right. Teeks is he's, Teeks is, he's kind of in the clear, though, I think, isn't he? I think if his bro moves up, if he plays four, he'll be in the clear. If his bro goes down, oh, he's really he's good, good now. He's good. Yeah, now he's clean. And he's getting movements for one. Yeah. Very so nice. we're just hoping that Haxer's bro doesn't decide to be a jerk and move between eight and nine. That would suck, yeah, because that'd be a useless star, right? Oh, even man, if look his at that. brother comes back now, that's not a big deal, but he would go for it. So let's see. He oh, did come what? back, dude. He did come yeah. back. So he's gonna secure it and then go back down. So that nine yes. second difference is almost lost now. But at least almost... he doesn't have to play four F one. That's right, yeah. Or, you know, ha not have that extra star. That star yep. is really useful. Oh, man. I know it's delayed, and that's going to bring the game a little bit closer together here. And I think it's going to put... Well, Teek still has the last bro fight, so I think Hacks are still in the slight lead here, but it ain't going to be by much. Yeah, Teek's already did his bro fight, so they, okay, are, yeah. they are pretty pretty even now. What, are we like three seconds, maybe? Where are well, you, Mitri? <laughs> <laughs> right? So... The biggest time swing there was definitely Ooh. the screen transitions. Those those eat time. Hacks are getting triple that. Triple screen transition. Yeah, hacks are feeding boss pass that ice block right off the bat, and Teeks having a little bit of a hiccup here, but nothing major. He's just splish splashing right in the water, yeah. you know. They swim, Remember man. Swim? 
<laughs> Nitri, get that egg timer. What's our difference? Four or so seconds? No, hell, if we can't do four seconds or so. Yeah, we gotta be exact here. <laughs> well, let's see two the H jumps. Two any four or two five, right? Any big chief H jumpers? Nope. Panda big. Almost missed it. Yeah, Panda big chief. Oh, oh no! He, oh, and he could have got the wall jump too. Oh. Well, they're gonna widen the gap a little bit there. Ooh. This is Teeks. incredible. Teeks has to be feeling a little bit of stress. I don't think either of these guys watch, so they know that any little tiny hiccup they do like that, you know, it's just at the pace these guys are playing is not going to help them at all. So this is nuts. Yeah, yeah as this, you saw, Choke there, um, Teeks' feet clipped into the wall on the H, and if you get the A input on there, you can actually get a wall jump. Yeah, he could have. He could have saved it there. I'm sure he tried, of course. Yo, thanks, drums. So what we have here is very similar World 1 RNG. Very awkward RNG uh, for Teeks in World 2, causing him to be behind by, I want to say, about 4 or 5 seconds. And then he went behind by a full 9 by the off-screen 1 grab. And then he was able to bring it back by Haxer getting bad RNG in World 3. So they both had their bad RNG worlds, and they both had a good one. Yep. And Mitri point out it's 8 seconds difference. Hey, Stewie Cartman. Hey, Stewie Cartman, if you're in here, you're not racing, so I'm not going to tell you to get out of chat. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So this is uh, this is going to be very interesting. You can't get an off-screen wall grab in this world, so we're, we are not going to see another one. The screens are panning perfectly. Do you see that? It's like... Yes. <laughs> it's like feeding into Teeks' side. Yeah, it's amazing. Yeah. Dude, I, I think Haxer does a little bit of a stomp kill, doesn't he? A no, he's just gonna go the traditional blast. Yeah, not this time. So what does Haxer get? He gets the 1541. Teeks doing the stomp though. Oh, careful, Teeks! Oh! Be about 10 second difference here? Almost. Oh, did not. He did. Oh man, he had a good opportunity to close that gap. The H jump really got him. Yes, the winner of this race, Nass Master, will race Jakubi. Just a little added pressure from anybody racing. <laughs> I the raced Jakubi. Yeah, I raced Jakubi in round two, and it was easy, let me tell you. I didn't have my uh, EverDrive get stuck in my NES and have to play All Stars version either. Ooh. <laughs> yeah, that's good. Uh, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it's a plus. It's exactly what happened. Oh. Top nice route for speed. Haxer here. Sure, Teeks is going to do the same. Both doing the faster than Mitch. Patented. Bottom route! Ooh! Ups, upsy downies. They just yeah. did the upsy downies together. It's pretty good. Haxer not getting the best. That's not ideally what you want to see, but he didn't see the star bro move over, so he's probably not stressing too much. Yeah. Nice then me and Chief raised Malachi, said. We didn't Teeks. raise Malachi. <laughs> Oh, Hacks are getting out of there clean. Teak's going to get this D... Oh, he didn't! What do you do wrong there, Mitch? I... I don't know. I, I saw I, him snipe the... He sniped the Koopa. Did he? Yeah. It looked like Weird. it. Chat maybe yeah, can confirm. I, I don't know. Weird. Or maybe his shot missed. No? You saw, him, you saw him kill it? Yeah. Weird. Oh. I have no idea. Teak's his bros oh, Teeks being bought. Yeah, man. These movements are four. Four three. Most most people say it's their favorite level to watch on a speed run. It's it's very cool to see executed properly. It looks like both these guys are gonna nail it. Easy town. Easy. That wooden block jump just scares me, man. I go for the strat where I just jump right over it. One tiles, one tiles when you're stressing are are very difficult. Yeah. Got a smiling cloud. Oh. Oh. Oh, Look Jesus. at these bros for Teeks! This is not getting good bros right now. Any Jakubi graded wacky lackeys here? The jump snipe. Nope. Nice jump though from Haxer and Teeks. Yeah, so Teeks might save Music Box and get the uh, P Wing here, right? Do I mean, if, if you're gonna be forced to fight the Star Bro, 
especially without using uh, the music box, right? That that's that's the goal, right? Save the music box. Yes. They both did they both get Dom box? No, Haxer avoided it, didn't he? No, no, they both. Uh, no, Haxer got it. He was forced to right after right. the fortress. So Haxer's in kind of an annoying situation as well. Teeks made it. What? <laughs> with with how that happened, that world four never ends up like that. But the Haxter's bro is right beside the bottom level, which means after the fortress he could move over, which means wasted music box, but he would get the P wing. Right. So less stress. No clip or wall jump. He'd have to decide. Oh what? Oh no. The That's gonna cost speed. him a little bit there if Teeks nails his P speed. Let's all let's all stop kidding ourselves and admit that P speed is still kind of RNG. Yeah, that P speed stinks. Yeah, it, it's a jerk. Teeks is gonna get it though. Yep, Teeks is gonna be able to catch up a bit. Even though Teeks got like movements of four and mini marathons in this world. Yeah, he's see, still hopefully... not far behind. Oh, oh the buttheads oh. did it! But it, like you said, it's P wing, so. Yeah, it should be. Yep. Okay. Yeah, <laughs> it should be. This is by time, Ness Master. It's first person to the finish line wins the race, and it's just a best of one race. This is a double elimination tournament, however. So yeah. the loser of this race will move down into the low, the lower bracket and still have a chance to come back. And pointing out here that Teeks was able to side scroll over his bro. Touch of luck. Right. So for anyone wondering in chat, what just happened was uh, Teeks now still has to either wall jump or clip. And Haxer doesn't have to do one of those. Depends on what he chooses. And it only depends if they both use the P-Wing and 5 one. So that's really all we have to look at. Hey, uh, Speed Gaming, uh, I think you guys' commentary uh, commands are not working right. <laughs> <laughs> that's not us. <laughs> yeah, World 4 mean? Airship. I World have to give, World after World. the screws here, I like to do the dad jokes. Let's see what we get. Right on, Lorgan. Are we getting the screws? Yeah. Oh, hacks! Are oh. you tricked us? You betrayed us! Oh, you both did! They knew it too. That the uh, scoundrels. Look at it. Look at Teeks taunting us. Teeks with the little tea bags there. Yep. Why didn't the pirate play cards? Because he was skinny. He was sitting on the deck. Oh. <laughs> God. <laughs> oh. Yeah, that's for you, Malachi. There you are, Mitri. <laughs> Beautiful. Just absolutely beautiful. That was so bad. How does a I computer like get drunk? It takes screenshots. <laughs> <laughs> I love crappy dad jokes. They're the best. Oh, Alright, that's all you guys get till later on. Maybe I'll drop you one on the World 7 airship. Hey, Bagler, what are you doing? Get out. I was saying blue eyes. <laughs> So as we know, not much to talk about here on the World 4 airship, but uh, we're getting ready for fire kill time, so there is plenty to talk about with that. I think Hexer has a slightly weird fire kill. It's like a movement of two. No, he got some jank jump. Oh, Teak's going to be able to get a little bit of time. Oh, wow. Oh, oh my gosh. Wow. flip-flopping all over the place. Oh. He got it, though. Teak's uh, takes the lead there. So... This, so Haxer has to use the P-Wing here. I mean, he doesn't have to, but it would be beneficial, right? It, so it's not, not a huge deal. Right. So you think he's going to he's gonna do P-Wing here? Yeah, most likely. And he's got it. He does. He has the extra P-Wing, so... And he's he's very familiar with wall jumping in 6-9, so it's not the end of the world. Yeah, well, he gets to choose, right? I mean, he could... If he's, if he's feeling wall jumps, he'll go for the wall jump and just P-Wing, so he only has to worry about one clip. That's a nice trade-off, but we'll see. These aren't accurate runners either, too, uh, Speed Gaming Bot. You're soiled. Hacks are going to play through it and keep that P-Wing. I like it. No, no, no. Teeks. Teeks. Hey, Teeks. I'm, I'm watching the wrong screens. <clears throat> Chat, you got me okay. fried. All right, well, so... Haxer doesn't actually need to do this, but I think he's going to try and do this and skip the bro, and it would kind of negate the extra bro he got. So that's actually a pretty good play. Yep. <clears throat> and then oh with... Oh, my God. Yeah. They switched. What? <laughs> Ooh! There was nothing crazy about that. I just wanted to be as fast. Yep, yeah, I know. They switched <laughs> on Haxer's side, too. Scoundrels. The real time to spaz out is the cloud over 
I heard that. I, I, I can't believe runners are still doing that. Yeah. That's a crazy play. That's what the kids do these days. Hacks are going with the damage boost here, which is definitely, you know, if you got the tail after you've done 5 1, that's the way to play it. Big Chief is wasted. Yes, I am, Kurt. Too much water. Too much salad. Too much Hello Fresh. Oh, and the P Wing's right there. He could prevent movements of four and get that safe P Wing. Oh, but he's not back for Hexer. oh, he's not going to grab the P Wing from that bro, though. He's putting him right to sleep. Peaks has a very juicy lead right now. Yes, and he if does. Haxer, if Haxer gets pulled in by that um, last Hammer Brother in this world, that will just be devastating. Yeah. Working on the bot. Oh, we're just messing around. <laughs> we're just messing around. The oh, bot's yeah, fine. Yeah, we we're hecklers in the SMB3 community, as you guys know. Teak's getting right out of here. Gonna... See what happens for Haxer. Yeah, I mean, That's he's not going to yeah, yeah. grab them anyways. But yeah. they're both in movement of four position. From Bottom bro, movement of four hurts the most. I think that one stings the most. Yeah. Oh. Peek's missing the P-speed there. That's big for Haxer. If Haxer keeps it, he's going to be able to definitely pull back some of this time. Oh, he gets it. And he does keep it. Hopefully he doesn't take damage here. Yeah, that's a scary spot. Oh. Hax keeps it through there, too. Peaks is still going to get out of here first, but Haxer's definitely closing the gap a couple seconds here. Yeah, missing the pipe just kind of throws Ooh. the whole momentum of the Twisty Castle A off. 278 from Teeks. I think we're going to see a 280 from Haxer. Yep. Juicy 280. No one's Haxer. ever died in 5-4. Both their bros in the top here are in weird positions. Ooh! <laughs> Ooh! Their last platform on 5-4 always gets me. Ooh! Yeah, one missed input, and you're toast. How do I think Teeks' hands are looking right now? <laughs> They're all I don't know. I am supposed to be mentioning uh, Dom oh, wanted me to... Oh, Teeks with the four movement. Haxer four also for with the movement of four. No P-speed on Teeks' side. Ooh. Haxer gets Haxer it! does get P-speed. Oh, oh, I thought Teeks almost died there. Woo! Is Haxer going to get the power up here? No. No, no, no. Slap He's on a got... star? Yeah. Yeah, yeah he's, he should be okay. Yeah, Dom wanted me to point out that Haxer said he was preparing for this race by eating a couple hard-boiled eggs. Well, you know, it works for different for everyone, you know? Yeah. Ooh, nice antiques here, just blasting very right nice. through this. So Haxer's in a very uncomfortable position. If the Hammer Brother goes right and down, he's forced to fight the Hammer Brother. If the Hammer Brother goes right fully, he's forced to fight the Hammer Brother. Only one movement, and that one movement will save him. The Hammer Brother needs to move up. Hammer Brother Haxer. needs to move up here for Haxer. Raw eggs. You guys in chat. Oh, he gets oh. it! Oh, my God! And look at that. He gets the skip. He needed that. Oh, man. No Jesus no. clip, Mitri. Only Stewie's tried that in the <laughs> tournament. <laughs> now, that's Stewie's move. Come on, guys. Oh, man. Did Haxer need that? He's got to be he feeling, feeling pretty good right now. That definitely helped. That did help. That did help a lot. See, now Teeks has to go fight it. And this is yep. where Haxer's going to catch up. And Haxer's going to take the lead here. I think. Let's see. Yep. Haxer is going to take the lead because he can skip this bro fight. So we're going to give him the audio back. What a race. They are very close, though. And like I said before, Haxer has the de stress P Wing. He's going to be yep. able to choose between. Uh... Well, Teeks didn't use oh, the, the P Wing. Deck, upper Decker! He got the upper decker. Oh, my God. So when you jump, uh, when you're going through a, a what is it, horizontal pipe transition like that, if you do a jump, like, kind of bonk into the pipe, you can keep P-speed by jumping out of the pipe. Oh, throne room jump. Uh, as you saw, Teeks ran directly into the pipe, so he was not able to, like, regain that P Oh, two oh, throne room no. jumps. Teeks is curling it right now. Oh, my God. This race is back. I told you guys at the beginning that this race was going to be insane. But we need oh. to see Teeks shake off some of these nerves. Because so, some of the ways he's doing these levels, just a little bit of knick-knack, uh, oh. whack troubles here. No where, poop block. Uh, wait, we got no blue block? No poop block there, though. There we go. Yeah, t I get. I see what you're saying, especially like that that pipe transition I pointed out there at the end of five eight. Teeks normally gets those with the jump into those. 
Yeah, I wonder why I saw that too. I wonder why he uh, he didn't go for the jump to keep the the P speed. I mean, it's only it, it saves frames, but I mean, with runners at this caliber, it's just it's frames just matter, nature, right? Yeah, I mean, you just you just know to go for it. It's just part of how you play. He's got Bubba James. James. I'm not that excited. Bubba James, you ain't seen nothing. Wait till we get to seven four. Yeah, just wait. Just wait till seven four. Yeah. Where's the SMP three bookies? <laughs> You guys don't have money on this? Oh, Hatcher, careful! Whoa, man! He almost got stunned, too. Teeks knows his fire kills, so... That was way cleaner on Teeks' part, making up some time there for sure. What's our time difference, Mitri? We're only looking at a couple seconds now. Oh, yeah, totally. And they both have the extra P-Wing, so there's no yeah. advantage here. Hacks had an 11 touchdown. He's gonna be like a 17, a 60, a five second difference? Five seconds. I wish we could put predictions on. Five seconds is like a World Six Hammer Bro Marathon. Yep. Right there. Or the extra bro. Well, actually, that's more. It's what, 10 seconds for an extra, or 12 seconds for an extra bro fight? Yeah, it's, it's a little less because of how many levels are left and all movements of zero after. But yeah, pretty much. We just chalk it up to 10 seconds. Oof. Upper pattern versus lower pattern. He's going to gain a little bit of time back yeah. from that. Oh, not a clutch chest grab, though. No, I'm going to have okay, to though. talk to him about that. <laughs> Peaks with a good movement. The, the only thing we're scrutinizing these guys run so far is when they grab the chest. <laughs> <laughs> That's all we worry about. Axe are taking it safe. Aggressive. And Teeks is aggressive. aggressive. Ooh. This is going to be some time save. Teeks gets the full jump. Is he going to oh, get his speed back? Axe are going for the aggressive oh, star. So Teeks going to do the same thing. I know it. Yeah. Teeks definitely just gained a couple seconds there. Yeah, Not man. Couple, at least a second. Oh, yeah. Look at that. It used to be five seconds. This is insane. So Haxer gets... Oh, no. Oh. See? Ooh. Oh, Teeks oh, gets... Oh, no. When they're Ooh. beside each other like that, it's so hard to avoid it. Oh. Both of them and... get just... Terrible movements. No early yeah. key speed. Teeks gonna get it. He gets he it. Get it. Oh man. A little more time. These are the things. Teeks is gonna even it up. I think he heard me. He's like, all right, Mitch, yeah. I'll, I'll get rid of those nerves. I have pull to. out the stops, man. These are the, the things. Hammer Teeks. Brother by Teeks. The Hammer Brother by Teeks is the one he doesn't want. At least yeah. I don't think so. Oh, oh. no. Man. Oh, Hexer gets. Oh, oh. No. he takes a death. The aggressive. No. Did he want to die? Was that the bad hammer, brother? It doesn't matter. He has to fight it anyways. He oh, went for the aggressive wow. guy. That negates T. T but he gets the cloud. RNG. He gets the cloud. Oh, and Haxer's guaranteed skipping this, bro. That death is so unfortunate. That allowed Haxer to get, or that allowed Teeks to get bad RNG. Crazy. Yeah, and now Teeks, Teeks did get the star, bro, there, right? Yeah. He did. yeah, he got the bad RNG. And Hatcher yeah. got his cloud. Both with beautiful despawn here. I'm going to get the audio back to Teeks since he is in the lead. Come on, get in there. My mouse isn't letting me switch. There we go. Ah, <laughs> oh, Teeks. At least he's right in front of the stone for Teeks. Exactly. Oh, nice. Actually, Hacks are back in the lead here with just that little bit of stuff. I'm keeping on top of this audio chat. Don't no, you worry. No, no. Nice. Oh, yeah. Nice P-Speed from both the guys here in this fort. I've never died in here on every race. Wait, I think Teeks does 6-9. Or, sorry, 6-10. Yep. So he's not gonna he's not gonna wall jump. So he has the P-Wing for 7-6. So Teeks only has to worry about 7-1. Uh, unless he changes. Axter's... Unless he changes because he has that P-Wing. Right? I mean, it is completely free. It's completely free to P-Wing 6-9. Deeks is catching up every level by yep. half a second, by the way. Yeah, everyone. this is incredible. Deeks catches up by half a second every level. Haxer is going for wall jump instead of 7-6. Alrighty. I like it. Ooh, he did the turn back, though. Yeah, I can't that, th that can throw off your uh, subpixel setup. Well, your subpixels oscillate from high and low with P-Speed, so you're always naturally having a 50-50. But when you Let's turn back, Let's see what happens here. First try, baby! Wow! They're, these guys are not giving anybody a chance. Teeks going for 6-10 so he can get that fast 7-2. Looks like he's going to nail it. He's going to be able to get some fire kills here. Ooh. 
Very keep it nice. clean. Look at that. Keep it clean. Nice. Do, 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 see. <laughs> <laughs> nice. Are we gonna see a clip here from uh, Haxer? See if he's got the gusto. No. Coward. No, yeah, he overshot <laughs> it, so he, he knew that when you know us watching, he's like, Coward. nice try, guys. <laughs> Ooh, Teeks I is thought Teeks, not either. I thought Teeks was gonna hit the ceiling there. No, he needs this fire flower for uh, all his time save. Be wasted if he exactly takes exactly. that damn. Ooh, ooh, get up there, Haxer. A little ooh. sloppy. Gonna have to talk to you about that. Yeah, nice, nice, beautiful boom boom stop. Beautiful door entry by Teeks. Gonna make up even more time. Yeah, how much by just time, right? Like he already that. has the orb. So we're pressed on thirty-four flat. So eight seconds right now, but oh, the throw room jump from Hector. Has he missed one yet? I think he's gotten every throne room jump. Yeah, Teeks goes to the level so he can get the fire flower to save it for seven two because you can just do a fast damage boost strat in seven two Nest Master with that fire flower already equipped. That's Haxer's right. gonna and either do a fast, kills. yeah, and the fire kill. Haxer is going to do a slightly slower strat there by having to grab an ice block and power up there in 7-2. That is correct, yeah. Is the fire kill on this boss? It's still a good bit faster than doing the stomps, right? Oh yeah, definitely. Teeks, Teeks. Teeks will, if Teeks gets a good fire kill, he'll bring at least two seconds. Get I know in it's there, a little Teeks. bit Oh, he got in there! This race is living up to the hype. It really is. My goodness. Like I pointed out earlier, guys, the, the loser of this race still will be in the tournament. They'll move down to the lower bracket and have a chance to come back. But as we know, there's some spicy guys in the lower bracket now, too. Uh, for opens down there now, and I would not want to race him. <laughs> Axe are going to go for sub-pixel manipulation. Is he going to let the wand land? Yeah, he's going to go... That's going to give Teeks a little bit of extra time, too. Oh, nice Teeks grab! Goes for the standing clip. Ooh! Jeez. Jesus. Seconds. And Teeks not going for the duck clip, which is. He knows you don't eat your pizza with a knife and fork, man. You get in there, big stand in Mario style. He fixed his sub pixel manipulation, too. He, he moved right and then moved back left again. Yeah, get Crazy. the grease out, chat. Get the grease out, everybody. MFP grease. Doom tap Greece, get it out there. Let's Top shelf go. commentary uh, says Greek legend. Thank you so much. We appreciate it. All right, here we go. Here we go. Haxer one for the guarantee. Guarantee sub pixel. Worked out in his favor. Come on, cheeks. Yeah, oh, baby. Oh, yes. oh yeah. This is what we want to see. This is incredible. Yes. Oh yeah. But this is where Teeks is actually going to catch up. Yep. Go fast. And let, let's stop pretending like Fast 7 2 some easy, everyone gets it every That's time, true. right? Like, this is very difficult strat. Oh, I'm actually gonna do the star, all right. Star, he doesn't have to stress about it. Yeah! Oh, he is ballsy here. Oh, he got the D spawn! Oh, man! He got the D spawn! Pipe the pipe? Who's getting piped to pipe? Oh, and he got the D spawn there, too! Teeks takes the lead! And pipe the pipe! Both of them! I am out of the edge of my seat now. I'm standing. This is nuts. Imagine Teeks got the fanfare there. That would oh, like no. even it back man. Up. Oh, man. All right. So now it's like, look at this sink. Look at this sink. Who sinks in World 7? Any sinkers in chat? Like, what is this? I'm keeping the audio on Teeks right now, but they're basically tied. That's right. Wowzers. And not I to work don't chat. like Teeks the 7-3. I'm yeah. not a fan of Teeks' 7-3. Oh, they get the old-school Wacky Lacky, both of them. Yeah, that's the old one. Oh, Haxer gets his one up here. So Teeks is still in the lead. Oh, man! I was wondering why. Yeah, see? Look at this. <laughs> I didn't even realize. Look at all those stars from Teeks' side. What's going on Fast here? Cloud, both of them. Nice. Oh, Haxer's actually down a star, though. Yeah. But he is P-winging, so he's fine. Yeah. Yeah, they both have two P-wings. Oh, that was that quick menu on Haxer's side there. Holy crap. That's right, man. The last item in your inventory. Always P-Wing here. Juicy, juicy. 195 pipe entry by Haxer. The spice! That's gonna let him make up a little bit of time, actually. The frames, Ooh. man. That was a faster kill on, on Teeks' side, too. Yeah. 
Wow. This is crazy. So. Both P winging it. This race, man. This race. Yeah, exactly, Mitri. The sweat. Is that the Mega Man 1 boss? I like that. So who does their last one up then? They both they both even out, right? I'm pretty yeah. sure. These reds, there's not enough for one one over. Yeah. Okay. Alright, so this is stress in a bottle. I don't even wanna talk Ooh. about it. This level is nice tail swipe. That was beautiful. Oh nice! Very that part nice. gets me nervous. Both of them get through! It's all about keeping P speed here. Hammer suits! He keeps it. Haxer keeps it. Oh wow! It's with a slightly slower strategy gives Haxer a chance to catch up. Hacks are technically in the lead. I'm going to temporarily give him the audio back. I'm staying on top of this. Keeps his P-Speed. Haxer yes. also keeps his P-Speed. Yeah, Haxer will get a temporary lead here until 8-1. <laughs> the one-up yeah. won't come back until 8-1, which is kind of funny. Now, uh, Mitch, just for the people in chat here, ducking hammer suit Mario, why does he not take damage from those uh, fireballs? It blocks the fire shots. Crazy. Does it block any projectile? No, it doesn't. No, it won't block potaboos or anything like that. Bullet bills? It's... No, Ooh, nothing. Only the... little, only fireballs. The sink. <laughs> oh wow, man, these guys! Oh, oh Arx Arx on the stairs! Hey, oh! Wow, Teeks takes the lead. Did... Yeah, Teeks already did his one up, so Teeks is ahead by by yep. a solid uh, four or five seconds here. This race, man. It's the hands, baby! It's the hands! Crazy. So many different things. Another interesting uh, Hammer Mario fact, he can't slide. No, he can't. Very weird. He he can only slide if you start sliding before you grab the Hammer Suit power-up. Yeah, that time. one... There's one level where you can actually do that, right? Where the power-up's like yeah. in a slide spot? Yep. <laughs> the one spot. He can slide one time. <laughs> This race, man. These guys are insane. Oh, that's Shark, that's to nice of you to say to Haxer. <laughs> what? <laughs> I know, Shark. I know you're saying it to Teeks. I'm just being a butt. <laughs> the hands are going to give these guys PTSD after this race, I think, unless they both get no hands. Yeah, what kind of interview can we give them? Yeah, you guys are neck and neck the whole race. Yeah. So yeah. what stood out for you? The fact that you didn't mess anything up or the fact that you didn't mess anything up? <laughs> right? It's like, oh, you got a death in World 6, but Teek's got the extra bro, so it didn't matter. <laughs> double no hands income. I want that, Jay Fred. I either want double no hands or all three hands for both of them. I want it even. Even, right? even. Even Stevens. What's chat think, right? We want all three hands or double no hands. These guys are playing spicy. You want to see both no hands? Yeah, Malachi, I like your spirit. We know in the land of Mario 3, though. That <laughs> those odds... What you want is not taken yeah. into consideration. Those odds are not in the runner's favor. I'm just going to start. You know what? I want the hands. Every world record pace run, you know what? Yeah. I, I kind of want hands, Why don't you just give me all three hands? Yeah, yeah. I feel hands. I, yeah, I want Reverse hands. psychology. <laughs> You mean they're playing spicily? Doom tap. Isn't it bad time in Canada? So Haxer music box before where T did after. So you're actually see, gonna see these bosses do two different things. One's gonna sit there, one's gonna Ooh. jump. Off screen wand grab for someone keep though. Keep it clean, keep it clean guys. Nice on both ends. Oh, Haxer went for it. Teek's ma maintaining that touch of a lead. World record pace, you wanna say that again? Yeah, Malachi. Yeah. <laughs> So Teeks actually has a little bit higher lead right now, mainly because Haxer has to still get his last one up from the bottom three cards. But other than that, they are very close to each other. So what level made the difference in having the extra card? Uh, um, Haxer got the music box in 5-1, and that's yep. not an end level card, and Teeks did. There you go, chat. Mitch has the knowledge that everyone needs. Got all the answers. All right. We also don't want to see any spicy. I mean, I don't want to say too much, but both of these first uh, World 2 auto scrollers have been known to uh, post some janky threats to people. 
when you get a little too cocky. Called them the world two auto scrollers, guys. World, oh, I'm fried. Uh, <laughs> judges, judges, can we get a score on that, please? That's a three. <laughs> It's better than World 1 auto scroller. There is a World 1 auto scroller though. <laughs> there is a There's World not even an auto scroller in World 2. <laughs> That's true. Redeemed himself. There is not an auto scroller in World what 2. Is it? They two, were... 2 and 4 don't have auto scrollers, right? Mm -hmm. 5 does. We just never get to see it. That is true. You cannot kill Koopalings with hammers. Yeah, but you can think... kill and kill Ko Bowser with them. <laughs> right? I think what happened before because Bowser has so much health like he's already technically overkilled. And right. So you just have to ham them with a lot of hammers, but with the Koopa kids, um, pretty sure that you were able to at one point able to kill them, but you they overkilled and it glitched and broke and they had to remove it. Sad. That makes sense. Super sad. They're doing the screen scroll thing again with the <laughs> yeah feeding it into one other screen here. Look at this craziness. Nice despawn here. The D lag is clean. Oh yeah, they're they're going for safe strats here now. Haxer actually had a slightly better uh, D lag than yeah. Teeks because he, as you can see, he's caught up a little bit on the. Yeah, pinch of time. Uh, forward or backwards, bro is definitely going to determine who's in the lead in the moment. And backwards, and backwards. backwards, backwards. And Teeks Teeks missed the hammer there. I think that let Haxer catch up even just touch more time. No, went straight just, for the yeah, jump. They had, to, they had to wait for the hammer to go off screen. So it was it was, it was all of, based on the hammer. The hammer? Yeah, the, the boomerang. boomerang. Oh, I'm sorry, the world two auto scrollers. You got it. You got me. You got me. I don't like that nobody goes for the fire grab here, man. I feel like they could get it. At least pop it. At least, you know, let it bloom, right? Like take it out of the block and then run away. Whoever does Nico Manip will win the race. Nico Manip is a scam. Dude, Teeks is causing weird lag right now. Look, Haxer is exactly on par from random Yeah, they're lag. like dead tied now. They are. All that weird, the D lag that Haxer did in the in the army, and now this, let him catch right back up. It's like dead yeah. tied. It's so weird. I saw Teeks get hit with a bunch of frames of lag on the boat here, which you normally don't really see. It must have been some hammer throws. Zero hands for both runners, Sharkit. We got to root on both the runners. Fair and balanced. Peaks is still ahead though by by, by that one up. Don't forget about that one up, ladies and gentlemen. Yeah. I'm biased right. to death. <laughs> St stick to your gun, shark, and I love it. <laughs> Ooh, this is where everyone at chat gets nervous. Even I'm a little nervous. I'm nervous at this right here. Okay. Peaks I didn't by catch Haxer on a. Oh! oh, oh He's got to go for the stomp. Oh my Ooh. man. And that, all right, it's the hands, baby. Maybe that overkill causes them to get no hands. We'll see. Teeks I'm sweating. Oh, oh hands three. three. Okay. Oh, oh hands three. three. Oh, my God. oh man. Oh this no. Teeks gets damaged. Oh no. That's it. Axer That's takes it. the lead back. That's it. And if Haxer, uh, if nobody messes up, this is Haxer's race to lose. That's it, yeah. Oh my god! Haxer's on pace for the win now. This is Haxer's race to lose right now because of that that loss of the hammer suit on Teeks' end there. Oh man. Ha Teeks lost his hammer suit in the hand with the darn cheap cheeps, man. That, That's what happens you, to you. They'll get you. Those cheap cheeps stink. Both got both got the same hand too. They both had hand three. Yep. Wow. I this said is... it. I said that I wanted them both to get the same number of hands, and darn it, the game gave it to us, guys. The game called the prayer, right? I mean. Yes. Haxer's not gonna check the sands this race. <laughs> no, he's definitely not. He's. Can Teeks recover? Only if Haxer makes a mistake. There's no way for Teeks to win this unless Haxer... I mean, there's going to be a touch of time gain from Haxer having to get the one up, but not enough. Not enough. Yeah, not enough. Not enough. Because Teeks mean, also lost time by taking the damage and having to slow down and re-grab the fire. That's right. Not doing the level as fast. I mean, he, each boom boom now is slower. Yeah. He needs oh, Haxer. Oh, Haxer getting Ooh. stuck in the ceiling. What are you doing, man? He needs Haxer to choke. That's okay, his only that's chance. actually good for Teeks right there. Haxer equipped the star. Teeks did not. 
Ooh, oh! Hector is choking a bit. The chokester! Oh, man! No peace, speed! What? what? Teeks pulls out again! One up. He's gotta get the one up, too. Teeks pulls ahead! Now, this it is, is worth noting that the, the time difference here can still be made up with the hammer Bowser kill, so it's not free for Teeks yet. Not yet. Oh, come on, Haxer. Come on, Teeks. Keep it coming. Come on, both of you. Ooh. Oh, he misses the hammer. Oh, he didn't get... He didn't miss that one, though. Me, though. Oh, my God. Wow. This race, guys. This race. This race. Hacks just got to play it clean here, man. He doesn't have a star, though, so he's got to yeah. go slower, too. He loses his hammer suit here. Teeks is in the lead by a big shot. Missing the H jump as well. Oh, can he get the P speed? Oh, Teeks got P speed and Haxer didn't. Teeks is pulling away oh, so no, hard right now. This is not what Haxer needs, man. This race. What is happening? It's going to come down to Bowser's castle, baby. Oh, boy. I didn't think Haxer was going to get the one cycle there. Oh, the miss! Got it! All right. Holy fish paste. The hammer yeah, suit is not faster in Bowser's Castle right now, is it? Let me see. I he enters at 49.50. It might be. I think. Oh, I don't know. That's about six seconds. And the hammer suit only saves about six or seven. This is insane. This is going to come down to like a... Should... This is going to come down to a second, man. Yeah, Haxer should be able to save time back. Uh, with the hammer kill they're essentially team. tied it's gonna come down oh, to yeah. crew clip or if somebody goes for elevator clip and gets it nobody's gonna go for it well teeks needs elevator clip to guarantee the win no matter right. what so but he doesn't know that no that is this is incredible this is insane <laughs> okay here we go i can't even take it man this race! Teeks pulled it so much in this World 8. Oh, and that, lu that lucky son from Haxer, he needed that. That was good. That was good. So T uh, Haxer needs to not mess up this hammer throw. Yeah. There we go. Okay, this no bumps. Race, man. No bumps for Teeks. If hacks their bumps, that's just adds to it. No bumps. All right, here we go. Teeks did keep P speed up top though. Getting Karuud. Oh no. Teeks got Karuud once. Haxer gets Karuud. He got Karuud again. Oh! That's gonna, I think that's gonna do it. That double Karuid. I think Teeks is gonna take it. Oh, oh no my way. god. That's what it is. No way. Teeks won. Teeks wins. wins. Teeks wins. Oh my wins. god. That is incredible. What a race. I've never even seen that before. Wow. A five second win. Wow. What? Oh my goodness, man. What? Ladies and gentlemen, oh we we have seen a race here. Oh my gosh. That's incredible. GG's to both of our runners. They both did a fantastic job. Wow.